Sometimes seen as a corpse bride, Mama Bridget calls upon us to face both our mortality and our ancestral lines. We are far removed from death in today's Western society, with the dying often hidden away in hospices and hospitals, and the funerary rites enacted by undertakers and embalmers rather than by family members and loved ones. What can we truly know of death if we are distanced from it? What do we understand by decay and decomposition if we do not experience it? How can we mourn fully if we are separated from our beloved dead within hours of their passing? Equally, what do we know of our ancestry? Can we trace our lines back through our matriarchal or paternal lineages? What about our spiritual lineages? How much do we really know about those who came before us, our beloved dead, and how they lived and died? In these instances, Mama Bridget is the quintessential mother. She who guides and nurtures, protects and cares. Aloha of liminal space. She stands at the threshold, welcoming our spirits into the land of the dead, as much as cradling our earthly remains. As such, she can be petitioned for aid when undergoing transitions of any form. But particularly physical or spiritual death. Or when faced with bereavement and loss. She encourages us to respect death and to understand its sacred place in our society. Rather than hold it at arm's length or be afraid of it. Mama Bridget is also the Loa of money, and thus can be called upon for help in financial matters, especially those of probates and wills. Again, she commands that we fully understand and respect the sacredness of these transactions. That said, Mama Bridget can be just as lewd and irreverent as Baron Samity, especially when we find ourselves taking matters too seriously. Again, standing in the liminal space between the two and sometimes steals his top hat and cane for her own enjoyment. She enjoys rum mixed with hot peppers, both as a libation and as an anointment. Resonates with the colors of purple, black, and white and her dances are legendary. Those who would prefer to connect solely with her more light-hearted side would be wise to exert caution. Mama Bridget does not suffer fools gladly, and she is forthright and plain in her speech. As she is a female Loa who is very much in control of her own power, as well as truly understanding the act and function of death, Mama Bridget holds her own destiny in the palm of her hand. She encourages us to reach out and take hold of our own destinies rather than going with the flow and thus living life while we can. An aspect of the divine feminine who is not to be feared. Mama Bridget is both the mother of the dead and a judge of their lives and of earthly situations. She is considered to be the wife of Baron master of the cemetery, and chief of all the departed ancestors, known as the Luagede. The grave of the first woman buried in any cemetery in Haiti is consecrated to Mama Bridget, and it is there that her ceremonial cross is erected. She, as well as Baron, is invoked to raise the dead, meaning to cure and save those who are on the point of death from illness caused by magic. Mama Bridget, like the rest of the Baron Gede constellation, is a tough-talking Loa who uses a lot of obscenities. She drinks rum laced with hot pepper, so hot that a person not possessed by a Loa could never drink it. She also is known to pass hot Haitian peppers on the skin of her genitals, and this is the test to which women are subjected when they are suspected of faking possession. 
she dances the sexually suggestive and remarkably artistic banda, and the virtuosity of her dancing is legendary. Bridget is a strong woman who teaches us that it's okay to be both a mother-wife and an independent person. Bridget is not so easy to pin down into stereotypes. She is devoted to her children and to Baron, but she is also full of her own passions. Bridget shows that you don't have to lose your own identity in a relationship or in your duties. You can have a thousand roles and still be you. Her offerings include cigarettes, black coffee, white bread and rum spiced with hot peppers. Her colors are black and purple. Her special day is Thursday. Mama Bridget, like her husband Baron, have Fat Gede, November 2nd, as their holiday. Mama Bridget's symbols include a ceremonial cross and scales which represent her sense of justice. The saint associated with Mama Bridget is Saint Bridget. Thank you for watching my video. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. And have a wonderful evening.